Brant the Lost Arcader, and we are back with Zelda Twilight Princess. Hey guys, back right where we were with uh, me being Brent entirely fucking clueless is what to That's do. That's what it was. Yeah, we were we were. Cause there's a switch. You see the switch? Yeah. Oh, dude! I had to use the creepy ass bird thing to get back in here. Yeah. I and that. oh man, I wish I'd waited till we could capture it on camera. We would have been one room behind. But that thing is just oh ungodly I know. unsettling. It's, it is the bringer of nightmares. It's like you want to go back to mama. Fuck no! You're both terrifying. Do I have no. mobs yet? God. That's no. not the button. There it is. Nope, no mobs. No mobs, yeah. yeah, yeah. That, that looks like you can kind of blow it up, doesn't it? Uh, is that just me? I that's just you. Maybe. You have your I do have booties, boots. though. That's your boots. Oh, shit, my life! Oh, my God. You got it. You got it. Run. Oh, God. Come on. <laughs> Run, Stompy Link. Yeah, and that's the thing. I've got to remember, don't use my shield, because it will burn the fuck up against those lasers. Yeah, and you have to go all the way the fuck back. Dude, I'm so tired today. Yeah. Sweet. Cup and cakes, I'm tired. Hey, there is a chest. We help them. Oh, man. So we were talking before we started uh, about... Turn this down just a little bit. There we turn go. that down a little. Well, and turn it towards you a little more. There we go. Uh, let's talk, we were talking about the power outage we had last week. Uh, it's fucking insane. We had like 15,000 people at that power and for like half the day. Well, every Sunday, me and my wife go out to eat. Yes. Uh, for breakfast. Oh, I got a piece of art! Oh my goodness, it's so vulnerable. Anyway, uh, <laughs> oh, that was a good I try. wanted to do that midair that so bad. Almost awesome. Uh. Almost awesome. But anyway, so I'm almost out of gas when we leave, right? Yeah. And so I was like, you know what? I, we just go to a place right down the street. It's called the Pancake, Pancake Station. I'll make it there and back. Ain't no thing. Uh, and so we got on the pancake station, of course the power's off, and we're like, shit, we're gonna have to go somewhere else. I'm like, okay, well, I got, I fucking gotta get gas. Well, what do you, what do the pumps need in order to pump <laughs> oh, the gas? Oh, they need some electricity. They need some fucking, I didn't even fucking think about it. You know, about the electricity being out for half the city. Oh, well, that's true. Oh my god, I, we were chugging. That is the closest <laughs> I've ever been to having to push my damn car on, on, on down the street. Oh, that's fucking embarrassing. Oh, dude, too. We, we almost had to go down. <laughs> we had to go downtown to get gas. Yeah, like a, a quarter to a third of our city had no power, and none of the goddamn stoplights were working. Yeah, it was, it was working. Like we had a little power outage for about two, three minutes here at my house, so it wasn't bad. Did yours do the flicker? Uh, it like, totally everything. Like, uh, like my house sounds like some sci-fi like battleship yeah. powering down with all the shit in here. So yeah, just for a few minutes, and of course that meant I had to reset all the goddamn clocks, which I oh, hate yeah. doing. And then our video recorder and everything, it like every like you went to watch TV and nothing worked. So I had to redo the video recorder and stuff. That sucks. So it was. It was the normal pain in the ass, but it wasn't too bad. But yeah, then we tried to drive places, and fuck you. Yeah. Like, none of the lights were working And anywhere. plus, the people in this town are a bunch of freaking morons. Yeah, they're, they're a danger to themselves and others when, when the know, work light, When the lights are working. When the lights yeah. are working, exactly. It's, uh, it, was, it was insane. Do I have something to deal with these yahoos? Yeah, you got the... You got the... You can probably... Slingshot? Oh, yeah, Are slingshot. you thinking? There's no way the goddamn slingshot's gonna do this. You don't think it, it reached that far just to interrupt me up and run forward? Oh, uh, well, at least not from where I was. Maybe here. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. Oh my god, and I can't move. Yeah, you either. got it. You oh, got I it. Did. Yeah, you did. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. That's a fucking rough Boom. slingshot. Look at that. Well, dude, slingshots back in the day were like, you know, uh, they that's were true. insane. Well, it's kind of like the boomerang was a legitimate weapon. Yeah, yeah. And I don't know if you if anybody's ever thrown like a real boomerang before. That shit is not kidding around. Yeah, those out. things are fucking heavy. When they I come mean, back they, down, you're yeah. like just waiting for it to behead you. Well, I mean, you know, especially if it had like a like a really nice edge on it. I mean, those things were hefty as hell. I mean, back in the Roman era, uh, the slings, not the slingshots, but the slings yeah. were, I mean, they were basically, you know. Okay, I need the bow and arrow to fight this, don't I? Yeah, you're about to eat shit. Yeah, that's yeah, not doing shit on a shingle. Hey, goodies. Got a, got a chest. Yay! So that was entertaining. What else has happened this week? Oh, we watched the entire first season of The Strain. Of the what? Huh? The Strain? What's that? It's uh, Guillermo del Toro's uh, 
uh, series. Sweet. And, yeah, it's actually fucking legit. Spoiler free uh, uh, description. Um, let me think, because I because I can't really describe it without mi minor spoilers. Well, then let's let's leave that alone. Here, how about how about on, only one minor spoiler, and that's that's what it what the what the creatures are. No, 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 no. People get pissed. And don't don't, find out don't, don't really say. On it. But anyway, okay. So spoiler free. Uh, it starts off with uh, you're on a, there. You know you're in an airplane with this thing, uh, and you see a creature pop up through the cargo bay, uh, and it just and it um, kills everybody in such a way that they're all in their seats. They're all like bluish gray, uh, and nobody knows what the hell happened. And so um, the main character is named F. He's from the CDC. He follows him while he tries to figure out uh, what happened and, and everything else. Uh, well, there's four survivors who, needless to say, they don't, they don't, uh, their lives don't turn out any for the better for having survived. Yeah. Um. Well, yeah, just bullshit <laughs> ensues. Oh, well, I, well. Can't, uh, can't say. Yeah, huh? well, it turns out, uh, they weren't exactly as, uh, as, uh, survivor as they thought. Oh, pod people or something. Uh, kind of, yeah. Um, but anyway, the creatures are, look pretty cool. Um, you know, it's kind of like a, it, it's got a really awesome, like, B-movie feel with some pretty good actors. The only thing, the only actor I just truly hate, just hate, is, uh, the main character's kid. Dude, that kid should not be acting. I'm sorry, kid, but I've seen some good kid actors. Uh, the girl who plays Little Miss Sunshine? No, yeah. she's not really a girl anymore. She's not that she, Yeah, she is, a, yeah. she is a lady at this point. Uh, I mean, the kid that played Sixth Sense, same thing. You know, we've seen some really good child actors, you know, uh, in our time. Who's the little blonde girl who was, like, a really good actor? Oh, she, yeah, yeah, played like Carrie. What? Played Carrie? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, she, yeah, the, the girl, uh, or played Kick-Ass. Played the girl she, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, that wasn't the one I was even thinking. I was thinking about the girl from, like, Signs who played that. Yeah, yeah, there you Fuck, go. why did I do that? Yeah, there you go. I mean, but this kid, man, this, it, he just, he delivers his lines with a, with a <laughs> monotonal fixation on pronunciation, if that makes sense. Okay. It's, it, it is like if I talked like this all of the time. Oh, okay. And it's just, it's, it is very, you know, fixated on pronunciation. Like so it's every, one of those things where every time the kid comes on screen, oh, you, God, you just immediately go, him in the dick. BOOM! Oh, man. And it's just, I mean, you, you tell he's trying, but it's just, it's it's so obnoxious. It really is. I've, I've got one of those people who's in my life this week. Uh, you know, there's just some people who play a part that you hate. Yeah. And, and that person will always be that person. Kind of like the kid who plays Joffrey well, on he, you're Game of Thrones. Him. You're supposed to hate Yeah. Like well, that. no, no, but this person you're not supposed to hate. Oh, God! Robin! What am I doing? What? This oh, is what all coming to Oh, my God! Oh, Everything's oh, falling oh, apart. The wrong uh, you're ah! oh, you Okay, got, got it. it. Um, anyway, uh, I'm, I'm re-watching Chuck, which is one of my favorite shows ever. And I forgot that the girl who played not Lana some, Lang on Smallville yeah. shows not, up. Not the movie Good Luck, Chuck. No, just <laughs> Chuck. Yeah. And I loved Smallville. I was one of those people who liked it. But it the was, thing I hated was Lana goddamn Lang. Like, yeah. I just hated her all the time. And so Kristen Carruth or whatever shows up on there. And I just started yelling, Boo! at the TV. That's My wife comes in. She's like, what the fuck are you yelling at? And I'm like, it's her. And she's like, she's great in this. What are you talking about? And I'm like, no, it's not that it's Karuith or whatever her name is. It's that she was Lana goddamn <laughs> Lang, and I just can't stand that bitch. Oh, I can't handle yeah. it. Yeah, see, Marcelo said he wasn't that bad, but man, like, and he says things that no 11-year-old would ever say. I mean, it's just, I mean, and I realize it's for exposition, you know, he pushes the story along a little bit, 
but he uses words and phrases that it's like, you know what, some 30-year-old wrote this like he was saying it and then said, hey, kids, say this. Oh, you mean in the, in the Guillermo in the show, del Toro yeah, yeah, show? Yeah, it's, okay. it's terrible. It, just, it bothers me. But the show itself is really good. Uh, it is. It, the first season is um, it drags a little bit, but the second season apparently is much better. Uh, but it's it's really good, and it, and I love I love it. It's my favorite thing whenever TV show whenever you think you've got a loophole, like you got well and, what the and fuck? then it solves what, it. Yeah, why why you know this this dude was in you know this dude is obviously you know to to match the timeline this guy's 104 years old. What the fuck? That doesn't even make sense. Except this that show's he is 104 years old. And then it's all like oh yeah he is 104 years old. And it's like, oh shit! And they explain how he's 104 years old and all this shit. And it's it's like, it it, it it they do that like five times in the first season, and it's awesome. So Mark, two quick things here. If yep. you've been paying attention, and I haven't. One, what sucks is they've disabled my sword in this room. Yep. And what is a Zelda game when you're not breaking pots with your sword? Two. Did I get when I found that piece of heart? Did it fill a whole heart container for me? Because it looks like I've got. I got five up yeah. there, and I thought I only had four. Yeah, you did. Woo! Yeah, you got a, you got a full heart. And his heart grew one more time that day. It grew one more size that day. Just like my penis. Just like his boner, because every time he saves the bitch, she doesn't put out. <laughs> Actually, no, Zelda's the one who does put out. We found that out in the second one. Oh, really? On the original NES? I don't remember that. Yeah, like okay. a curtain goes down, and like it stops at the beginning, and you see her like walk up, and her little like feet are there, and it's like smoochies, it's on time. Okay, well, so, yeah, I was like, I don't remember any like God of War esque sex. Yeah, there's no gratuitous, you know, yeah. knock the pots off the bedstead. Which kind is of probably the most but. hilarious sex scene ever if you haven't played it. Oh my god. God of War 3. And it's in all of them, isn't it? Well, the, the God of War 3 one is especially... I've, ne I've only played through God of War 2. Oh, God. It is a 12-year-old's idea of what a threesome should be like. Well, that whole game is like what it, what that kid drew in his trapper. Yeah, 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 like yeah middle fair school. enough, yeah. But, um, but no, like, I, God of War 1, like, I played it forever and... You know, I didn't have a lot of time back then, so it took me months to beat God of War 1, and I was super excited for God of War 2, and I was kind of shit poor, so I saved up and didn't buy other games and stuff for God of War 2. I sat down, and no lie, I played it for 14 hours straight. Nice. And beat the game, and I was like, <laughs> son of a bitch, there's like my video game budget for like four months. And I beat it in one sitting, so I was really pissed off. And so I haven't played any God of Wars just out of a sense of vengeance. Well, I mean, ever God since. of War is good at what it does. <coughs> the only issue is, I think, uh, Kratos himself. Oh, good gets, lord. You know, I mean, at, at the God of War 1, he was, you know, you, you kind of had a little bit of understanding of his motivation. You know, yes, his family was killed, and you're oh, look at this brick shit house. He killed his family! Yeah, though. I know, I know, but, I mean, you can understand his, uh, his anger, he wants vengeance, whatever. But by God of War 3, he is just, I mean, he's unrelatable. An unrelatable, angry, just freaking devil. It's insane. What do I do? Don't get hit. Ah! <laughs> Whoa, fuck. Yeah, that, 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 that hurt. That felt bad. Dodge. <laughs> Penis. I should have put my boots on. I was trying. I clicked the button. I don't have my boots to the... You know what the what button the boots should always be on on this game? The bottom button? Down. Yes, because those are boots. They yeah. go down. And I was... I, whoa! Oh, no! I got all of those hearts? Yeah, it didn't kill you, it just put you back. Son of a bitch! It's just like, it's just like most of the, the auto deaths, you know, it's just the... You, you, you. Boink! He's still gonna beat your face. Yeah, that's why I don't want the boots on, I want to be faster than him. Back up, back up. There you go. Like back that, up. okay. Hook in the belly. Yeah, King Hippo style. He's not, he's, yeah, there you go. <laughs> 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 Eat shit, bitch ass. Oh, sucks to be you. 
Batty. You gotta probably do it three times. Let's Come see. get me! Who's your green daddy? That's what he says. Back up. No! Let's get him to curls! I'm trying! Oh! You can't put the boots on when you're locked yeah, on! Yeah. Okay, so well, that's that. shitty. Try! I hit the button like three times! Again. Yeah, it you was have to time. yeah, you have to uh Oh no! Oh. Girls are watching. Actually they're not here. That's okay. Okay, well, uh, we'll pick this up next time on the next credit, because our quarter's up, man. Oh, so sad. Bye, everybody! Later, guys. Bye!